Stay up past your bedtime. Space is proud to sponsor the Midnight Madness program at the 2007 Toronto International Film Festival. At the Witching Hour, get your fill of shocking and rocking films. The Midnight Madness Program at the 2007 Toronto International Film Festival, September 6th to 15th. Brought to you by Space. Wilson, yes! It's been a while. Um, we've known each other for about eight or nine years. Um, we were both helping a friend, a Shilasi, in that friend's movie, and he was in charge of the action, the action part, and it was in charge of the story part. That's how we met. So we first asked Donnie what kind of, what type of actions he would like to uh, to create in the movie. For example, in, in uh, SPL, it would be um, kind of like the cops and gangsters type. So uh, we'll start from there, from the idea, and then we'll, we'll try to create that effect. So that's where we start. He doesn't, he doesn't play with storyboards. He would just go straight to the action. But most of the time, he has a blueprint in his head. Uh, but usually on set, uh, we will have new elements add it to the action. Not exactly in improvising. Uh, usually he would try it out with his assistants. After a few rounds, if things don't work out, he will, he will, uh, he will revise it. Uh, but he usually plan it out uh, before, before doing it. Um, so apparently in the scene where Tiger was running away from the hospital, and he was kind of hit by a truck on his way out. He wasn't really hit by a truck, he was kind of just like touched by a truck. And uh, Donnie was try trying out the position uh, for him, for Tiger, but uh, he actually was injured in that scene. And that was the most serious injury. <laughs> And uh, also the actor for uh, the actor uh, who, who was playing Tiger, he was hit seriously in the face by uh, by Donnie in the in the street uh, street eatery. Uh, that was uh, quite serious, also. <laughs> and uh, the actor who played Tiger was also in Kung Fu Hustle, playing the uh, Kung Fu Hustle. And uh, Colin Chu, um, he, The Matrix Two. And he's also fought Jet Li in um, Bodyguard from Beijing, amongst other films. For, for uh, you're so quiet for a director who makes such intense films. <laughs> Just an observation. <laughs> <laughs> All my anger was handed to Donnie to handle. <laughs> and actually my inner personality can be quite violent too. <laughs> All right, we have, uh, yes, in the black there. So the question was, uh, is it, does uh, Wilson think that it's uh, difficult for, because every film Donnie does, he seems to go farther and farther. Is it difficult for Donnie to continue to top what he does previously? Is that a challenge for him? He can, with me. And just to mention that there actually, uh, it's kind of almost a trilogy because there's SPL, Dragon Tiger Gate, and also this, so it's their third outing with, uh, with Donnie. Why is the time period of 1997, the time uh, just before the handover uh, of Hong Kong um, back to China for the British and the the story? Uh, uh, <laughs>
，不過好累啲嘅，所以就可以要設計九七年前，九七年後就安定繁榮嘅。Uh, it is a matter of politics um, because from the mainland China's uh, perspective, Hong Kong before 1997 was quite uh, quite a mess. Uh, it was you know a lot of violence, uh, a lot of chaos, and uh, after uh, after the handover in 97, now it's all stable. It's everybody's happy. So yeah. <laughs> what was the most difficult part of uh, shooting this film for you? 最困難都係同誒甄子丹溝通啊，即係因為同佢，我我都俾好多喺佢嘅動作上嘅情緒上嘅意見，咁誒、嗯，但係佢有佢，佢有佢獨特嘅諗法，咁喺喺呢喺呢喺，所以喺 ending 呢場戲會會最困難。有時我會覺得佢打得多啲，就係、是、有時我覺得佢。Um, the most difficult part was to communicate with Donny uh, because he, he has his own ideas and opinions about fighting and shooting the action scenes and I, I had a certain vision to achieve in, in character development and, and the story uh, and so for example the last scene, um, the ending scene, the long fighting sequence Sometimes I thought it was too long, too much fighting. Sometimes I thought it was not thorough enough. Maybe he wasn't hit enough. Um, so, uh, so that was the communication problem that was the most difficult. The question is, uh, what is Wilson's influences and where does he see Hong Kong cinema going forward in the future? Okay, John <laughs> Woo. 杜琪峰，杜琪峰，誒、呃、香港電影好危險咯，好危險。<笑>我覺得會少咗好多香港認識嘅電影，會多咗好多亞洲嘅電影，即係同國內合作多咗啲。My、um, idols, my inspirations are John Woo and Johnny To. And... And the way I see the Hong Kong film industry is that uh, it's in a dangerous position. Um, we, we might see less Hong Kong, made in Hong Kong movies, but we might see a lot, a lot more Asian movies, a lot of collaborations with uh, mainland China. Um, so that's what I see it, how I see it. The great thing about wire work is when you don't see it. <laughs> MMA 呢種打法係即係甄子丹佢好想，即係佢好佢覺得而家全世界最好打嘅都係用 MMA 嘅嘅嘅拳手，咁佢又成日推薦俾我，咁所以佢佢係佢嘅夢想嚟嘅攀成，咁用威亞嘅嘢，我覺得誒睇、呃、下邊睇下戲種咯，有啲戲我覺得有時用都加咗個反應嘅力度都。冇乜所謂，但係喺呢部戲就除咗架車撞到個人，飛起嗰度有有啲提到有，其他都冇用。咁因為係希望接誒甄子丹同我都希望比較真實少少嘅打到。In terms of、uh, MMA, it's、uh, it's really Donny's dream to make a movie featuring MMA fighting. He 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 thinks that the best fighters now in the world are MMA fighters. <laughs> So that's that's why he、uh, he insisted on, on on using a lot of MMA style techniques.、Uh, in terms of making、uh, making movies with wires, it really depends on the genre of the movie.、Uh, sometimes, if it really augments the force, the strength、um, in the in the in the effect, it really doesn't matter. But for this film, the only scene that we used wires was when where、um, Archer. Yeah, where Archer was、uh, kind of hit and he was flying into the air. That was the only scene you,、uh, we used wire.、Uh, other than that, everything else was real.、Uh, because、uh, uh, Donnie and I had this vision of making it re look realistic, so we decided against it. All right. Thank you very much.